Welcome, in front of me is a Nokia G21 and today I'll show you how we can enable the power saving mode. So to get started, you want to pull down your notification panel, like so, come on, there we go, like so, expand it and a look for the toggle for me it's right over here now it is grayed out so let me quickly fix that by unplugging my device because i am charging it there we go so my battery is quite low right now at 28 percent so let's go back to it we can tap on the toggle as you can see it gives us a pop-up uh turn on a battery saver battery sa saver will restrict power consumption uh, activities background apps uh, app activities visual effects gestures uh, touch sounds, uh, vibrations, etc. Automatically to save power. So let's just proceed by tapping on OK. Now it did drop the brightness a little bit as you probably just realized. So that's one of the things. Now I'll mention one more thing that it will do. I'm also gonna plug it in back to charging. What it does when charging it, uh, charging your device or plugging it to charge, it automatically turns off the power saving mode as you just see right here but going back to the power saving mode once enabled uh, apart from what it said uh, I'm gonna quickly go into explaining it so it basically terminates background activities like apps that are running in the background even though we can see a bunch of them uh, there they are all at the moment kind of turned off so if I would, uh, open them up you should technically need to reload for some reason it didn't maybe because I'm charging but anyway, that's one of the things. Number two uh, would be it turns off Wi-Fi and mobile data when you uh, when the device is in sleep mode. This is considered a sleep mode, just so you know. And because of that, any kind of application that will require internet connection like Facebook, Messenger, WhatsApp, uh, Instagram, and so on will not give you any kind of messages that someone might have sent to you uh, when the power saving mode is enabled and when you're not using the device. Now, once you wake up the device again, so like this, um, it will reconnect to Wi-Fi and mobile data, a one or both of them, and then sync up whatever it was missing. So if you're wondering why you're not getting any kind of messages uh, that are internet-based, that's basically why. And uh, that's basically probably one of the more important things that I can say about the, do not, the, the power saving mode. Now, one last thing for some people that might be interested, uh, there is, you have the option right here to change the brightness. Now, power saving mode did change the brightness just a little bit by decreasing it uh, just a tiny bit, but uh, you can actually utilize that if, for instance, uh, you're using the phone at night, uh, you can just drop it halfway, and I know it's barely visible right now, but dropping the brightness does significantly increase your battery life. So you might want to utilize that more over the uh, actual power saving mode just because the display brightness has a better or bigger effect on your battery life rather than the actual toggle right here but anyway that being said if you found this very helpful don't forget to hit like subscribe and thanks for watching